Seattle's jazz scene of the 1920s was geographically remote, but it was not removed. My most recent project is a prohibition era jazz band called Greg Ruby and the Rhythm Runners. We recently finished making a record featuring compositions that were written over 90 years ago by a local jazz musician named Frank D. Waldron. It's the first time that Waldron's music has ever been recorded. Frank Waldron never became as famous as his star students Quincy Jones or Buddy Catlett, but his presence reaches back into the earliest days of jazz in Seattle. In 1907, he set up shop at 1242 Jackson Street. There, he established the Waldron School of Saxophone and Trumpet. Performing throughout the Northwest, by 1915, he joined a string band called the Wang Doodle Orchestra. With an ear towards composition, Waldron self-published his first composition in 1918, adding to the canon of World War I songs with a lively piano rag called The Kaiser's Got the Blues Since Uncle Sam Stepped In. Since recording studios didn't exist during that time, Waldron's only option to archive his music was by writing it down. So, in 1924, he self-published nine original compositions in a book titled Frank D. Waldron's Syncopated Classic. A few years ago, I located a single tattered photocopy of Syncopated Classic and was moved by its brilliance. Musically playful and technically demanding, it captures the relentless joy of the music of the 1920s. Immediately, I knew these compositions needed to be recorded. 93 years after Frank D. Waldron put these songs to paper, we get to hear them again and get just a glimpse into Seattle's raucous musical past. Mm -hmm.